Last Friday, officers at the Burbies River Bridge were able to intercept a truck with cattle stolen and being transported for slaughter on the west coast of Burbies. It was an alert constable who noticed that the animals in the truck were carrying a fresh brand and informed his suspicions at the outpost. According to the chairman of the Region 6 Livestock Producers Cooperative Society Limited, Rupnarine Matadial, the truck where the cattle would have been checked at, by officers at the Albion Police Station and the Lewis Manor Police Outpost situated along the east coast of Burbies Highway, but it was not detected that they were stolen. Cattle rustling have become a lucrative business in Region 6, not so for the cattle farmers. I've been carrying every cow in Savannah, and the cow went there, and just so, just so, then got having a little detail. That's how long, back? During holiday time. That was Mahindra Gajadar of number 57 village quarantine. Matadial explained that in order to pass animals in a vehicle by the police in Albion, one has to pay a fee of $10,000 per head of animal to obtain a pass. This document is then checked and verified at the Lewis Manor outpost. However, last Friday, none of the officers at the two locations observed that 11 heads of cattle that were in the truck had two brands. But the documents presented only corresponded with the fresh brand and not the original one. The stolen cat belonged to Mohammed Nadir Hussein, a farmer of Wellington Park, Quarantine Burbies, who was the owner of 11 heads of cattle, and Sahadio Etwaru of number 35 Village, Quarantine, who owned 150 heads. I knew this animal to graze, and on, on, on Thursday, Thursday afternoon, I looked for them, I didn't find them. And on Friday morning, the following Friday morning, I received a phone call that four of my animal was going uh, uh, in a truck at um, the four animal in a truck at the bridge, uh, Borbis River Bridge, and they put this whole lot up there. They didn't come and they get the car and they load up the truck. Okay, they go sell the gibbet, they brand the car with the father brand. A guy in the kitchen, 90 over CV, the fresh brand that they put on the four animals for me. Okay, they were brand new and they were fresh brand. Yes, they were brand new. Okay, they were brand new. But you had a brand on your Yes, animal. my brand, big on the animal, C46M. Both sides on the animal, C46M. It's a dairy animal. Meanwhile, Matadial is calling on the relevant authorities to take swift action internally against the police alleging condoning of cattle rustling. He claims that a butcher on the west coast of Burbis boasts that he can get stolen animals past any police station in Burbis since he has the contacts. There's two police locations I made to understand that these rustlers are passing these stolen animals. That is Albion Police Station and number 19 Police Outpost. And I would like the authority who are looking at this to take some action internally against these policemen who are doing this wicked act. And most of these animals are earmarked for raising sun butcher, um, avatar, sorry. What I, information that I gathered, the, the accused, Kishan, he said that his boss man paid all transportation. He hired a truck from West Coast to Kurt. And he arranged to get in transit. He paid the police. All payment is done through the boss man of the butchery. I don't know who is the boss man of the avatar. But he said, the, the accused said, he's the commander of all the rustlers in Region 6. According to the Criminal Law Offence Act, Chapter 801, Section 177, the offence should carry a 14-year jail term.